see the drip, yeah, I'm fitted up. Hop in my car and the giddy up. Secure the bag, yeah, I get the bus. Pick it up, pick it up, pick it up. You see the drip, yeah, I'm fitted up. Hop in my car and the giddy up. Secure the bag, yeah, I get the bus. Pick it up, pick it up, pick it up, pick it up. Ooh, I've been on the flex since flex zone. Good morning, morning T -Birds. T Birds. It's Sophia. And I'm Nick. Today is February 2nd, and you're watching the Mount Tolman TV. We want to welcome Mr. Parks, who is here with a special message about attendance. So good morning, T-Birds. This is Mr. Parks, your Dean of Students. And I want to thank all of you who have made the effort to be present and engaged as we've started the second semester. I can tell you myself and the principals have definitely noticed a shift. Starting next week, we are taking extra steps to address accountability with attendance. So one of those will be following the 10-10 rule. And if you're out of class in the first or last 10 minutes of class, you'll be escorted back to that class. Another step we're taking is reintroducing after-school detention. This will be assigned for students who skip over half of a class period, along with being assigned for students who continue to, vi to violate our tardy policy. Um, our intent here is not to punish any student, but we really just want to make sure we work on accountability when it comes to being present and engaged at school. So thank you for your effort. Uh, this Monday, baseball and softball will have Ox Gym workouts open, so go check that out Monday, Wednesday. Uh, and that's on March, it's going to end March 2nd, and then baseball season is going to start in softball. So go check that out. You know, you guys can get some practice in, get ready for the season. And now we're to the sports talks. And here's Tal with today's sports. Good morning, t -Bird. So today and tomorrow, boys swimming versus West Central District Championships at Malta Homa at 5 p.m. And boys and girls wrestling also have a sub regionals today and tomorrow. Girls at Spanaway Lake and boys at Mount Tahoma at 4 to 10. And that's it. Senior yearbook deadlines are coming soon. Senior quotes and, and baby pictures are due February 14th. Make sure you visit tinyurl.com slash tbirdyb for more information. Uh, the Golo Tolo, February 2nd. Um, come, come check out tickets in the comments. Prices are $4 and uh, $6 without gas application. Forms and papers this time are available at the Mount Tahoma website and are uh, due by February 20, 21st at noon. And here's our MT brother man Jordan with this weekend's weather. Good morning, t -Birds. I'm Jordan with your weekend weather. Today you can expect some rain sometime later in the day. There's also a flood warning for Tacoma, so be on the lookout and stay safe and dry. Um, as for the weather, it's 48 right now. Um, it's kind of sprinkling right now. And you can expect some rain sometime later in the day. And it's going to be around 50 degrees uh, around 2 o'clock today. So when you leave from school, it's going to be a little warmer, but you might not even notice it. Anyway, back to you. Are you planning on playing a sport? This Monday, February 17th, you can start clearing for sport, spring sports through the athletic office. Stop by at lunch or after school to sign up for, to get the forms you need to complete. All sports start Monday, uh, March 2nd. Well, that is it for today's news. I'm Sophia. And I'm Nick. Uh, thank you for checking us out today. And uh, yeah. And we're going to end today's uh, broadcast with the class spotlight, which is tech, Teach 253. <laughs> Something that I expected my first year that I took this class was to become a teacher, you know, like go into a classroom and start teaching. And that's actually something that we did last year. We went to Manitou and I got fourth graders, for example. Other people got first graders, kindergarten, fifth graders. And that was different experiences for everybody. But that's like the number one thing that I was expecting for us to go into a school and start teaching or helping out the teacher, you know what I mean? Um, right now, we're learning, you know, how to create a healthy learning environment. And we're also like getting our portfolio done for seniors. All things teaching, all things education, all things learning, um, especially building relationships, you know, uh, with the students among the peers and building relationships with the um, teacher, which is myself. But just learning everything that they can possibly learn about making sure students learn in a healthy and respectful, thriving environment so that they can be the future educators. Because Washington is recruiting teachers of diverse backgrounds because that's one thing that's lacking here. So don't be afraid, you should sign up. 